hopefully you've been able to enjoy the cooler temperatures of late because I don't think they're going to be sticking around too terribly soon, too terribly long. Tomorrow, in fact, we'll see sunny, warm and breezy conditions, even warmer on Monday. In fact, I think that will be the warmest day of the next seven to 10, 86 that forecast high for your Monday. And as we go into the kind of the rest of the work week, we will drop back into the lower 80s is still well above average by about 10 degrees. In fact, so let's kind of take a look at these records here. So Sunday forecast high 82 degrees, 10 degrees warmer than our average. It gets even more impressive by Monday with that 15 degree departure from average. Our record for Monday's date is actually 89 set back in 1954. So we'll be very, very close within the margin of error, so to speak, for Monday's potentially record tying or record breaking high Tuesday, slightly cooler 82 again, still a solid 10 plus degrees above average and those highs notice this bottom line here staying well above average. So right now pleasant 67 is where we sit right now in Rockford. Our friends to the north in Madison 63. You head to the west though Des Moines still sitting at 74 72 in Iowa City. 74 in Waterloo. Now the warmth is certainly going to be heading our way, but we don't have any rain chances ahead over the next seven to 10 days. That's why I've got no pause points here. In fact, with your future track, just a few passing clouds basically each and every day through the work week. Mostly sunny sky though is expected. For tonight, we'll see mostly clear skies. Those breezes will finally start to subside. We've had some kind of blustery winds all afternoon. In fact, gusts upwards of 30 to 40 miles per hour in a couple of locations. But the gusty winds will finally begin to ease just a bit. Southwesterly winds 5 to 10. Again, temperatures dropping to the upper 40s to low 50s for most areas in the state line. Mostly sunny for your Sunday. Again, warm and breezy. 82 for that forecast high and notice those southwesterly winds gusting upwards of 30 miles per hour. Now we will not have much humidity to deal with. That's great in terms of how it feels, but if you're planning on doing any yard work outside tomorrow, any kind of burning or anything like that, avoid that because we'll actually have very, very low humidity values and very, very breezy conditions and that certainly spells a fire out of control pretty quickly. Again, for your day tomorrow, wind gusts upwards of 30 miles per hour, especially during kind of the heart of the early part of the afternoon between say 12 o'clock and three o'clock with those sustained winds between 15 and 20 out of the south and southwest. So as we go through the next seven days, we have fairly quiet weather. As I said, the warmest is going to be on Monday and let's take a look at your most accurate 10 day forecast. Temperatures are going to start to cool off just a little bit by the beginning of next work week, not this Monday coming up, but the next one in that eight to 10 day time frame.